As of 2023, his net worth is estimated to be around $110 million. This staggering wealth is a testament to Martin Lawrence's enduring talent and hard work in a fiercely competitive industry. Born on April 16, 1965, Lawrence made his way into the world of comedy and acting, crafting a legacy that continues to shine brightly. His journey started with stand-up comedy, leading to a breakthrough role in the hit television series Martin in the 1990s. He then transitioned to the big screen, with notable performances in films like Bad Boys and Big Mama's House. Key Contributions to Martin Lawrence's Net Worth The lion's share of Lawrence's net worth has been earned through his successful acting career. His hit TV show Martin aired for five seasons and was pivotal to his success and wealth. But his entry into the world of film significantly amplified his earnings. His acting in the Bad Boys franchise, alongside Will Smith, was a commercial success. The three-part series, released over two decades, contributed significantly to his net worth. Martin Lawrence made $32 million for all three Bad Boys movies. Martin Lawrence was one of the highest-paid actors at the turn of the millennium, averaging two movies per year and running successful TV series, from 1991 to the 2003 release of Bad Boys 2. His reputation is what reportedly got him a $6 million payday for the original Bad Boys film. After returning for the sequel, Lawrence also received a lofty raise matching Smith's $20 million salary. When Bad Boys for Life was released, Lawrence took home an estimated $6 million for his role in the film making around $11 million less than Smith and proving the fickleness of Hollywood. The Bad Boy film raked earning of $141 million at the box office. With the success of the Bad Boys franchise it's no surprise that Will Smith and Martin Lawrence collected over $30 million each from their portrayals. While there is much speculation about the fourth Bad Boys installment, it's unclear how much the stars will be paid for reprising their wildly popular roles. While this is just a fraction of the actor's net worth, both Hollywood Walk of Fame-honored entertainers have earned their reputations and the salary that comes with it, and continue to create quality work. The Big Mama's House series, a comedy trilogy that enjoyed box office success earning over $170 million, it further displayed Lawrence's versatility. However, acting is not the only source of Lawrence's wealth. His stand-up comedy specials have also earned him a substantial income. Moreover, Lawrence has dabbled in production, contributing to his overall net worth. He also managed to rake in substantial income from National Security, a project that earned him $20 million. Black Knight and What's the Worst That Could Happen also contributed to his net worth, and he earned $16.5 million and $13 million respectively. Here's a breakdown of his salaries from other movies. Blue Streak $20 million, Life $8.5 million, Nothing to Lose $6 million. Stand-up comedy. In addition to his acting career, Martin Lawrence's wealth was bolstered by his successful stand-up comedy tours and hosting gigs. Lawrence's comedic talent and charismatic stage presence made him a sought-after performer in the comedy circuit. His stand-up shows, filled with hilarious anecdotes and sharp wit, drew large crowds and garnered critical acclaim. Lawrence's breakout moment in stand-up comedy came with his appearance on the television show Deaf Comedy Jam in the early 1990s. His energetic and side-splitting performances on the show catapulted him to stardom and solidified his reputation as one of the funniest comedians of his generation. The exposure he gained from Deaf Comedy Jam opened doors for Lawrence, leading to successful stand-up tours across the country. Comedy is a powerful tool. It allows me to connect with people, make them laugh, and forget their worries for a while. It's a gift I cherish, Lawrence once said in an interview. Hosting Finchers. Alongside his stand-up career, Martin Lawrence also ventured into hosting. He came on board as the host of the popular television show Deaf Comedy Jam, where he showcased up-and-coming comedians and helped launch their careers. Lawrence's natural ability to engage with the audience and his quick wit made him a compelling and entertaining host. During his time hosting Deaf Comedy Jam, Lawrence solidified his status as a comedic powerhouse, earning praise for his comedic timing and rapport with the performers. His hosting skills further cemented his place in the entertainment industry and contributed to his overall wealth. Martin Lawrence's success in stand-up comedy and hosting further enhanced his financial status and contributed to his overall wealth. His unmatched comedic talent and ability to connect with audiences have left a lasting impact on the entertainment industry. House and Cars Martin Lawrence enjoys a luxurious lifestyle, owning prestigious properties in Beverly Hills and Encino, California, as well as a farm in Virginia. His opulent residences reflect his immense success and wealth in the entertainment industry. In Beverly Hills, Lawrence's property sits on a sprawling estate, complete with panoramic views and state-of-the-art amenities. 
the lavish mansion boasts multiple bedrooms, a private theater, a swimming pool, and extensive grounds that provide privacy and tranquility. In addition to his Beverly Hills estate, Lawrence also owns a magnificent property in Encino, California. This residential paradise offers a serene oasis with beautifully landscaped gardens, a poolside cabana, and a tennis court. It provides a serene escape from the bustling city life while still being close to all the conveniences of Los Angeles. Furthermore, Lawrence embraces the charm and tranquility of country living with his farm in Virginia. The sprawling property features picturesque landscapes, rolling hills, and wide-open spaces. It serves as a sanctuary for Lawrence where he can indulge in his love for nature and enjoy a peaceful retreat. The actor has a magnificently decorated house located in Los Angeles, Beverly Hills. The home stands out with its neoclassical approach, making the estate one of the ultra-posh ones in the neighborhood. The massive seven-bedroom structure has a lot of beauty in its lavishing Mediterranean Spanish style and lays in an area of two acres. With his impressive assets, Martin Lawrence's luxurious lifestyle extends beyond his real estate portfolio. He has a penchant for exquisite cars, fine jewelry, and exclusive fashion brands. Lawrence's passion for luxury is evident in his collection of high-end vehicles, including luxury sedans and sleek sports cars. He also adorns himself with fine jewelry pieces, such as diamond-encrusted watches and stylish accessories. Lawrence is also known for his craze for acquiring some of the most exclusive automobiles, an epitome of perfection that simply matches his fame. Among his collection of antique cars stands the 1967 Plymouth Barracuda, one of the most popular convertible cars admired for their classy look. Moreover, his Aston Martin V12 Zagato has been the center of attraction for a while. 2018 Chevrolet Suburban. Martin is often seen using this very vehicle for his stand-up shows and award functions. The exterior has a sleek yet imposing design cloaked in glossy black. The interior gets seats upholstered in premium leather and technology way ahead of its time. With a price tag of $58,280, the Chevrolet Suburban gets a 5.3L V8 engine mated to a 6-speed shiftable automatic transmission that squeezes out 355 horsepower and 383 lb-ft of torque. The vehicle takes 7.3 seconds to reach the 60 miles per hour mark and achieves a top speed of 108 miles per hour. 1996 Ferrari F355 Spider. Next up is the Ferrari F355 Spider, which Martin got back in 1996 and keeps very close to his heart. He often takes out the vehicle for his weekend rides and enjoys them, as posted on his social media. The exterior has a sleek aerodynamic design while the interior is quite spacious for both the driver and the co-passenger. With a price tag of $78,400 the Ferrari F355 Spider boasts a 3.5L V8 engine coupled to a 6-speed automatic transmission that generates 380 horsepower and 268 lb-ft of maximum torque. The vehicle goes from a standstill to 60 miles per hour in 4.6 seconds and goes all the way up to 183 miles per hour. 2018 Land Rover Range Rover Autobiography a family man always needs a spacious vehicle, in this case, a Range Rover autobiography. The exterior is featured with a sleek and stylish design with LED headlamps and tail lamps. The interior is spacious and the dashboard is dominated by a massive 10-inch touchscreen which when mated to the crystal clear sound system makes every ride comfortable for the celebrity and his family. With a price tag of $141,995, the Land Rover Range Rover Autobiography has a tried and tested 5.0L supercharged V8 engine mated to an 8-speed shiftable automatic transmission that generates 518 horsepower and 461 lb-ft of torque. The vehicle goes from a standstill to 60 miles per hour in 5.1 seconds and attains a top speed of 150 miles per hour. 2018 Rolls-Royce Phantom. Who keeps their hands off the Rolls-Royce with that kind of money? Martin owns a Rolls-Royce Phantom, most possibly the 2018 model. The exterior of the vehicle is very sophisticated and elegant. The interior gains seats in premium leather upholstery and a host of advanced features that undoubtedly make it the most comfortable and luxurious sedan in the market. With a price tag of $492,000, the Rolls-Royce Phantom has a 6.5L twin-turbocharged V12 engine mated to an 8-speed automatic transmission that squeezes out 453 horsepower and 531 foot-pounds of torque. With that amount of power, the vehicle goes on to achieve the 60 miles per hour mark in just 5.6 seconds and achieves a top speed of 155 miles per hour on clear highways. Martin Lawrence also owns the Kubota RTV 900, a diesel-powered utility vehicle that is designed to handle a variety of tasks. 
the maximum power output is 21.6 horsepower and the top speed is limited to 25 miles per hour. The exterior is rugged and stylish while the interior is designed for comfort and convenience with a deluxe split bench seat, digital instrument panel, and additional underseat storage. And there you have it, a glimpse into the lavish lifestyle of Martin Lawrence, living like a billionaire. He continues to enjoy the finer things in life. From opulent residences to exclusive purchases and even extravagant hobbies, it's clear that Martin Lawrence knows how to live large. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below. Subscribe for more exclusive insights into the billionaire lifestyle, and until next time, live large.